Sucking on my titties like you wanted me, calling me all the time. Like Bondi, check out my cushiony behind. It's fine all of the time. What, is that what else is in the teaches of peaches? Like sex on the beaches, huh? What? Uh, right? Uh. So delicious. Nice. Oh, so delicious stuff. Right yeah. <laughs> fuck the pain away. No, it's fuck the pain away by peaches. I uh, know. Is it? Yeah. Oh. Oh, I thought you were talking about Fergalicious. Like no. Fergalicious definition. Make them <laughs> yeah, go that's, what that's what I was God going for for some reason. I thought that Fergie. was. I thought that was Fergalicious. No. Oh. Fergalicious. What's up, guys? It's the Friendly Fire Podcast, episode 18. Yo. Hi. Hello, we're, we're legal now. Oh, what up? We're, we're legal. We're discoless. Also. It's a podcast. Everybody's hey, here. You can say it tonight because Disco's gone because no, he disco. hates that. He was here. So, so how are uh, you guys doing? Oh, who was here? What's doing up? Doing good. How do you guys here? Not good. Why, Sean? I don't know. Don't oh, say that. Right. Way to bring us down. Nobody cares. Yeah, dude. It's been a good night. We uh, just, we I'm just being honest. We Not all did thing. something illegal tonight, which was really fun. Whoa, wait a minute. What do we do? Uh, oh, we oh, watched yeah. a certain thing. Is it we illegal weren't... to watch it, or is it illegal to be the one to download or upload it? I don't know. I'm I don't just, think it's illegal to I'm, watch it. I'm playing. It's, it's, I don't think it's illegal to watch it. But let's not say what we did either. Yeah, let's just no, let yeah. it kind of sit there, and people you don't can be like, "Want to actually implicate yourself on a recorded medium?" They don't know what we did. They never, know, we never I'm just saying you don't want to. I just Ever. don't think it's illegal to watch it, though. It's, I mean, it's I mean, what did, what did you do? I, I see nothing. I know nothing. <laughs> well, we can always edit this part out. Yes, you know right. nothing. John's. Oh. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have to edit it out. All right, well, Patrick. Nate, Nate just Yo, duplicated all what have you been playing? What have I been playing? I've been playing No Man's Sky. Really? Yeah, Drew. More like yeah, No I, Man's I, Buy. Yeah, yeah, worth. Yeah, everybody. Uh, yeah. I've been playing No Man's Sky and loving the fuck out of it. Is it it's finally good? It's good. Okay. As I said... In, Earlier to Sean, I feel like it's like sixty eight percent of what they promise right now. It's what? A, That's such an exact number. Well, we he did the math. We yeah, <laughs> he did the math. I did all he the research. You can do anything, I so do. you can do sixty pre sixty eight percent of everything except for true multiplayer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean like Ugh. they said you could do anything. Anything. They promised anything. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Whatever. You can mine anything. <laughs> can, can your game do this? If I say yes, will you buy my game? Yeah. That's basically Sean Burgess. It's going to make show. America great again. That's right. <laughs> Too soon. Let's buy it. Don't bring that up. Uh, besides No Man's Sky, what else did I play? Um, I played Stardew Valley because it's Stardew Valley, and I'm a chump for that shit. Yeah, Jared. And I'm loving it. Jared so much. Podcast. Yeah. Did yeah. he play Stardew? Yeah, Jared played Stardew. Yeah. Yeah. I, I didn't know. He's, he talked to me. He's talked to me about it before. Yeah, it's exactly the kind of game he would like. Yeah. For 15 bucks, like I said, totally worth it. For how much content you get out of it and how how replayable and addicting it is. Very yeah, nice. Super fun. Um, besides that, I jumped on Just Cause 3. And really? Why? Fun. As you should. Because it was for free on PlayStation Network this month. So it's I have, fun. I just it's have fun as fuck. the opportunity for the joke. <laughs> <laughs> it's done. Uh, why Just Cause? Uh, oh, I forgot to say that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. David Drew, your own setup. I was just hoping he would get it. All right. Swing and a miss. Why? Uh... It's no, the game is just dumb and fun. Like, yeah, that's, that's the best is. way to describe that game. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna wrong. lie, it like it's amazing. I love the water graphics in that game for some reason. Like the whole knowing that nothing is really like buffering when I'm like paragliding all the way. Like the whole map is generated already. You know what I mean? Yeah, mm -hmm. you can go anywhere at any time, and you're not gonna. Have to I've stop never seen like. It, like I'm, I don't want to bring up your favorite game pretty much ever, but like you know when you're walking and you kind of get ahead of the game in Skyrim and you see like the mountain rocks trying to like still focus and like render and, stuff. and render in yeah the old like 360 version PS3 yeah yeah, yeah. I uh, a little rough like I've never seen that in Just Cause for how big of a you know map that is why shut up it <laughs> just, cause. God. <laughs> just Cause I said it there <laughs> God damn it uh yeah. Nothing, nothing too crazy. Uh, no Man's Sky has kind of got most of my attention. Other than that, just mobile games, and uh, I started up some new animes, but nobody cares about that. I do. They're good. I care about new Check animes. Them out. It's a different podcast. I know. We could have an anime podcast. Sure, we could. Let's do it. We did once. Well, way no, back well when. do it again. Way what you back do? When. What you been playing? What have I been playing? My mom. <laughs> 
Fucking leave. <laughs> Please. In that game, you lose your identity. Mm. <laughs> oh. 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 I mean, he's not wrong. Uh, ask you gotta get close to the mic. In that game, you lose your identity. <laughs> Thank you. Is there an echo in here? Echo? Sean, what have you been playing? What have I been playing? Uh, a little bit of Battlegrounds, obviously. A little bit. What are you doing now with Battlegrounds, huh? I am streaming Battlegrounds on right. Twitch oh, to five people we now. We finally have like yeah. an FFG stream. Yeah. I mean, we technically always had one, but we just never used it. Nope. Scary yeah. games coming soon. Yes. yes. Please yes. do. You said it, yeah. I will be streaming scary games at some point and on Twitch. Up. Please uh, play Evil Within. Play Resident I Evil 7. I still think uh, fucking Outlast should be your first one. Yeah. Fuck. So Fuck. good. <laughs> Tune in for me shitting my pants. I think we should maybe we should maybe like kind of ease him into it a little bit, you know? Just no, last. balls of the wall. Let, let <laughs> give him that courtesy. Evil Within's a good mix of horror, it's a good action. game. We'll yeah. do uh, what's that? What's that Sega CDI game that they're remaking now? What? Uh, what the one where you had like it was like a house and clock like, tower yeah. house? No, we're not. Cl- shut up. <laughs> not a clock tower. Um, you had like security cameras and you keep going through and trying to like five, see nights, five nights at Freddy's. <laughs> no, it was back <laughs> on the <laughs> Sega CDI. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's oh like, God! Oh, I know what the sh- Sega CDI. Or yeah, the it's Sega- like legendary because it got like a bad rating because there was like a bathroom scene. It was like live action. Yeah, I know. I know exactly what you're talking about. Oh, I know. And you're it's like no. This is being... one of like the two games that started the ESRB. Yeah, back when. Yeah, yeah, and they're oh, remaking shit. it right yeah, now. What is this game I saw called? like advertisements for it. It's like night something or. We'll have to look it up. Yeah, I can't remember. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna Google this right now. Until the internet. Anyway, Sean, yeah, scary games coming soon. Yeah, it will happen. I will. uh, Man, I can't wait to see. I will be wearing. I will be wearing a diaper. Lag of sleep. He's gonna get so much (laughs) lack of sleep. (laughs) Every once in a while, I'll like jump through his window and scare the fuck out of him. (laughs) I'm not going to tell you motherfuckers when I'm streaming. I'm just going to be in your house waiting. You you have to tell us. Yeah, you. <laughs> It'll be amazing. No, don't. There's we no, will all tune into that. I'm going to have an eight hour stream uh, delay. Night trap. <laughs> eight hour stream. Night trap. Night That's trap. what it's called. Yeah, night yeah, trap. Night trap. Yeah, you never heard of night trap before? No, I've never I know heard you've it. seen it. I know you've seen Maybe. it before. You, it's you only have... famous because that and like Mortal Kombat were the catalysts for the ESRB. Here, this is so. this is the this is the cover art, Drew. It looks like that. It's like old, like actual people oh, kind God. of video game. It yeah. was weird. It was like one see. of the first like Sega CDI podcast, and, like games. What she look like? Oh, I've, I've, yeah, I've, I've seen that. Yeah. Well, the remaster. I bet people stream that when it comes. Oh, out. they're going to. It's going to oh, be yeah. ridiculous. Oh, okay, funniest, these are, these but, are screenshots yeah. from the, from the game. So this is not this, good for the audio. I'm just showing Drew so he knows what he's doing, what he's talking oh, about. It looks like a bad 90s TV show. Yeah, it's a bad... It's seriously like Melrose Place on, uh, on that CD. That looks amazing. Yeah, right? Good the God. graphics are so realistic. Yeah. Well, they, but, uh, I mean, they are realistic. It's almost like watching a movie. That's the joke. Oh, hey, there's the shower scene. Is that, a, is that that's, really a that's game, That's the reason why the ESR <laughs> yeah, right. game came up. <laughs> I don't really get to game if you just what, make all the decisions as you walk around. <laughs> why are my pants tight all of a sudden? Right. Anyway, uh, like I said, I started tr- uh, streaming on Twitch... Uh, if you want to go to twitch.tv backslash FFG underscore Omega, I'm still working on the stream schedule at the moment, but um, if anybody wants to donate any horror games to the cause, I will definitely stream anything well, I got a couple that's I'm submitted. Oh, yeah. um, other than PUBG, uh, Rocket League. Obviously, yeah, yeah, surprising nobody ever. You say that every fucking every week. Time. That's like that's like your hardcore or all the way through. I played Rocket League. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, a little bit of COD Four remastered. Finally. Oh, what else did I play? Um, fuck, I think that's. I played something else, but for life. I'm of me, super I cannot, glad you guys are playing that again. For life of me, I cannot remember what it was. Um, I downloaded a couple of the. Games with gold this month. I think I forgot to download Bayonetta. Tr- Trials is one of them. I kind thought of, yeah. I downloaded yeah. it. Is that Trials. not available anymore? It was available. Yeah, like two days ago. Oh, boo. Boo. Trials and uh, the 361 is uh, Red Faction Armageddon. Nice, which, pretty fun game. Which those yeah. are very, very. Yeah, Red fun. Faction Armageddon is super fun. You can They're destroy very, everything. Very underrated games. Gorilla yeah. was better, but Gorilla was better. Oh uh, yeah. I just like the gravity gun from Armageddon. Like yeah, that was pretty crazy. That was <laughs> fun as fuck. That was a cool one. Yeah, it, it's it's kind of like a. Well, it's similar to the one that was in Half Life. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So everyone remembers. <laughs> Never forget Half Life Three. Half Life Three confirmed. Yeah, Valve. We're making a new game, but it's not Half Life Three. <laughs> what? What was? Didn't we was talk it about that? Game? Yeah, we talked. We talked about that. It was a card game. I know we took like like three or four years off or whatever the fuck it was, <laughs> but yeah. 
We're, we're making they make a card, a, game, card game, guys. Games. That's what everybody wants. It's Hooray. a card game for Dota 2. What are you gonna have? What's gonna happen? Or is your brain gonna explode when they release like Dota 3, Portal 3, Half Life 3? Just like all in, in the one, same year, all in one massive bundle at the same time. It's like five hundred dollars for, for every <laughs> game. <laughs> There's no way he would ever do that. There's no way Gabe would ever do they're that. They're never going to get the sequels to those games in general, so yeah, it's not going to happen. Half-Life 3 is never going to happen. There's it, too much. Half-Life 3 will not happen in our lifetime, let's face yeah. it. Like, we're all going to be dead and gone. Gabe's going to be dead and gone. And that, then all the people are just like, I, I've, only, I've only heard tales of the legend of Half-Life 3. Half-Life 3 is like StarCraft Ghost. If yeah. you guys remember oh, that game. Oh, I remember Please that. Don't. Yeah. Oh, Please yeah. don't. Yeah, I have like really hurt feelings from that game oh a game i wanted to play this week but i haven't got a chance to yet and i still need to purchase it uh starcraft got remastered and released on monday oh is that finally out 14.99 yeah 14.99 i had no idea it was coming out until i looked at my phone one day and it was like on reddit i'm like fuck really didn't know like they kept saying oh it's gonna be released in august but and then they just fucking just Dropped it. There's That's been a bunch of drops this August, mm. video game wise. Surprise! So I will probably be playing that next week. Uh, brief glimpse of, into what I've been playing next week. Nice. Worth. Uh, I didn't actually play a whole lot of games this week. I played a little bit of Forza Horizon Three. Um, I'm just uh, kind of just grind. That game. That game's just a grind. You for just the most part. Are you just hyping up for the new Forza game when it comes out? I. I, I mean, honestly. The ra- the simulator Forzas, I-, I haven't really liked those as much as the Horizon games because the Horizon games are a lot more free roam. They burn out. Bur- yeah, kind of. Well, burnout is linear for the most part, but uh, like Forza, you can pretty much just drive anywhere, and like you can like this. The current one's set in the Australian outback, so it's really fun to like set or um, build like off road cars. Run over and shit. kangaroos. You can drive anywhere mm-hmm. in Paradise. Burnout Can Paradise. You? I yes. guess I, yeah. I haven't played Paradise. I, I've, I've only played the the ones for like original Xbox and stuff. Oh yeah, no, they opened it up well, to where the you old numbered around. ones. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I, I never played Paradise, so I didn't know that. Um, so just kind of grinding on that game. You know, there's not a whole lot of progress to be made. I'm just basically just like kind of collecting money for better cars and stuff. Uh, played some Rocket League. I got back into GTA Five this week actually. Um, after online ha- or just playing online, online. yeah, online. playing GTA Five online, <laughs> and I haven't logged in the game for like six months at least, and I got like, um, and I was surprised there wasn't any updates for it. I hadn't played in six months. I'm like, great, there's gonna be a fucking huge ass update for it, and there was nothing. I just got right into a, right into an online lobby, and then <laughs> since I haven't logged in for six months, it says, congratulations, you've been awarded seven hundred twenty seven dollars, which is like. <laughs> Ooh. Which buys you like a T-shirt in the game. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm like, thanks, I guess. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. What am I? <laughs> the hell am I gonna do with this? So my account's at a whopping like 34 grand, which is nothing compared to there's there's people that have like modded accounts and lobbies and shit that they play in. They have they have like a half billion dollars to blow. Yeah. I'm just going, what the fuck? Like I don't have time. I don't have time for that. The game has just become crazy. Well, I mean, it's still fun. I definitely still enjoy playing it, and I kind of. Oh, some of the ideas people come up with, like with the yeah. crazy, like just they turn the the game itself into a mini game. Like, yeah, it's like Mario Maker in a weird way. Yeah, you can make your own maps and stuff. Like there was this one map that I played where um there was like constant falling debris, um and you had to run up this hill and shit. Yeah, and, but it was it was a. It was basically a free for all, but there were no you couldn't use guns, so you just had to run up this hill and not get smashed by objects and shit. Yeah. But there's like there's like people and bodies falling at the same time. And like, like airplanes and shit. Yeah, there's like yeah. airplanes and tanks and like forklifts and shit like that. You just have to you have to avoid getting smacked in the face by them. It's super fun. We used to do that in Halo Three, actually. Yeah, it's forge. A, it's, a, it's yeah. yeah, it's like a forge. Map. Like just a debris generator. Yeah, and then we had these man cannons exactly that were the shooting thing. at you. It was so much fun. It was it's the exact same thing. It was super yeah. fun. There was one that I saw where it was just a giant ramp on a car, and you you know you'd fly up and be in the air, and they had these targets. It was like shuffleboard, kind of in a weird way. Oh, and you had to parachute, and you had to parachute yeah. in <laughs> and land, and now that's all it is. They just turned this crazy, ridiculous Grand Theft Auto game into like because like yeah, Super Mario Maker. They, they, like they a have a they have a bullseye way. on top of the biggest skyscraper on the, on the <laughs> yeah. in the game, and yeah. then you just have to like launch your car off, and like you have to parachute at the right exact time. And like float your car down onto the bullseye, or try to knock off you know anybody else, yeah, anybody else, yeah. Can, yeah. Um, and then I played 
I played a little bit of Ghost Recon Wildlands, actually, um, Ooh. mostly because my, my brother was kind of egging me on to play it, and I'm like, yeah, I didn't really give that game much of a chance, I guess, but uh, it is, it's fun when you have people, but it's boring as fuck when you're by yourself. When I was, I played like a little bit by myself, I'm like, yeah, this this is not something I want to do anymore. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, if, if you're playing with like, you know, another person or you have a whole squad, then it's really fun. But, nice. But, uh, yeah, that's all I've been playing. Drew? What you got? Uh, I've been playing One Piece Pirate Warriors 3. Yeah. You hear that, Logan? He um, makes terrible life decisions. <laughs> oh, he did not hear so that, any good. of that. Uh, I've been playing Madden. Still playing Madden. Yeah? How's that uh, How's that Fantasy League or whatever you want to call it going? Ultimate Team. Ultimate Team. Yeah. What's the name of your team? Uh, the Von Millers. The Ultimate Team. <laughs> the Von, the <laughs> that's Von Millers. A, that's the name of his team, the Ultimate Team. Yeah. I don't um, get the reference, but it's funny. That's their. He's a footballer. That's like their best player on their team. Oh, okay. Cool. Uh, anyways, uh, I've been playing Mad Max. Oh, you talked about the last time, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's still fun. Yeah, still yeah. fun. Nice. I, can't, I can't put it down, man. It's just something about it. Just kind of like a shits and giggles game, kind of in a way. Or are you like invested in the story and stuff? Uh, it's it, the story's minimal. Like you're just trying to get your car back like they took your car mm-hmm. and they scrapped it you're just so you trying to build it again uh, you meet a guy and he starts helping you build the car yeah from scratch nice and you upgrade it and you upgrade yourself basically what i said it was equivalent to was shadow mordor but with cars but yeah mad max but like but you get out of your car like it's you're not just relegated to your car you're you're actually out like trying to take down, like, oil bases and fucking fighting all these fucking dudes. So it's not just in your car. There you go. You can upgrade your character, new moves and shit, finishing combo moves and shit, just like Batman and Shadow Mordor. Yeah. Like, same combat system. Nice. Cool. Uh, Hots. Hots. Surprise nobody ever. Yeah, that's my... (laughs) my, There you go, Sean. (laughs) We beat you to it. Uh, and another game that Sean mentioned earlier, StarCraft Remastered. Oh, I, did you get it too? Yeah, you know she I played it. Up I knew you. Fourteen ninety nine. I figured yeah. you were gonna get it. I'm yeah. gonna fucking wreck you. Oh, dude! I the first yeah, live stream. There you go. <laughs> there's another. Terrible. There's your Twitch right there. Like, another thing. I went. Uh, I went back and played my first game in probably a fucking decade. What race? Uh, Protoss. Jeez, why does it got to be a race? Okay. Question. Jesus. Uh, but fuck fuck. I was I was so terrible. Like <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't build I couldn't I just couldn't build. Like did you I, need additional pylons? I did. I tr- I tried building them and it didn't work. And I was like, "Where's all my money? I should have more money." Red but Warrior needs food. So wrong game. Sorry. Cannot mine minerals for shit. So yeah, you would destroy me. Micro Stop that. managing. Yeah. But did I, you uh, did you play any uh, battlegrounds? This- oh no, you didn't. No, fuck I didn't. you. <laughs> no, I didn't play any battlegrounds. I'll kill you. I'll play. I like that game. Prove then it. Do it. Prove it. Okay. If you can't Worth tell how angry Fly Battlegrounds Sean is. I'm no, no, no. I, no, it. I did play. I played around the tour Battlegrounds. I did. Not with me. Yeah, not with you. But I played <laughs> with Jake and Nate. Yeah, fuck you. Thanks. Oh, yeah, the one night I fucking couldn't play it. Oh, well, tough shit. <laughs> hate you. <laughs> hey, good. That? I hate you. <laughs> no, that's all I've been playing. Don't have kids. What about you, Logan? <sighs> Lurgan. So my uh, surprising nobody ever game is a uh, siege. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah. siege. Well, that too. That'd I've be actually been itching to play Skyrim again a little bit. I was thinking about that the other day. <laughs> Jump so back in. I, yeah, I fucking love that game. Got so I had uh, an Xbox One. I just wasn't using, so I traded it in and got a bunch of money at GameStop. So I got a couple games. I got the uh, Call of Duty Remaster. So I've been playing that. Giggity. I still don't really like Call of Duty games in general, but <laughs> I wanted a game. A multiplayer game that was you died quicker than normal. You know, a lot of like Battlefield and and other games, you have so much more health. And I also wanted a game that was like um, you're more familiar with. No, 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 just like simpler. Yeah, just like where um, Titanfall, you die kind of quickly. Oh shit, yeah, I'm kicking that. <laughs> and Titanfall, you uh, you die kind of quickly, but it's so crazy and fast paced, and you have Titans dropping, which are a lot of fun. But I wanted something simpler. Um, and I know Sean and you know Worth and the, you guys like playing it, and you have it, and Sean's normally pretty good at it. So I was like, just get some. Not we'll, tonight. We'll get a group to go. And Jared Bogue got it too. So nice. yeah, I want to play some yeah. COD Four. Yeah, I want really to jump bad. on that. So I there were glimpses of my M40 skills. Don't yeah, deny it. you had some good shots today. It was great. So, um, so Fucking I uh, I've been playing. Uh, I got Crash Bandicoot actually. 
Yeah. Wow. Trilogy. I started playing No Man's Sky. Nice. And I started uh, a. Yeah. That's a great game, Drew. <laughs> he didn't. So, he didn't hear you. That's like. Did you just your, hear what he that's said? That's like your opinion, man. So I, I haven't I, played it. So see, I've never played it either until this newest update. It's why I got it, and it was on sale for like twenty three bucks or something. Um, eh, that's not bad. It's a lot of fun, honestly. I like the I like expo- exploring. Like in Skyrim, I'll just pick a direction and walk. And in this game, I'll pick a direction and just do my hyperdrive, you know, across the galaxy, find yeah. a new planet, and it's cool. That's fine. I'm just digging Sean it. Sean Murray advertise it that way. <laughs> well, it, like Pat was saying earlier, it's it's. I think it's getting to the point where it's a lot of people, even the, like people kind of reviewing the update, if you want to call it that. They're saying it's it's a big step in the right direction. So I think it was a good time to get into it. Yeah, I, so. <laughs> I I can't really fault him for for patching the game, yeah. especially after so many people were pissed off about it. But yeah, I'm I'm glad I didn't play it. Uh, how many original. class action lawsuits does it take oh. to get a game to where it should yeah, be right. advertised? Launch? It, can I say though, just real quick, in defense, how many video game companies do you know that if, if that would have shit bombed like that, that they would have been like, we're just going to take our money and run? Depends on the company. I deep not, silver. I get that fucking uh, home front. Revolution, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, we're not yeah. They just got PTSD. <laughs> I just I have PTSD. Fuck I appreciate a developer or a company that realizes the mistake they made and they're actually putting forth effort. Yeah, I'll I know we're that. gonna have biased interests and in on this. I'm just saying personally. No, I'm I'm with you on that. A Pat. person who believed in the game and was you know I'm not gonna lie at first an idiot for pre-ordering it. Now I'm actually happy with what has come from it. I mean, it, at the end of the day, if you're happy, that's all that matters. Yeah, and, yeah. No. You know me; I'm not a multiplayer guy in general, so the whole like lack of multiplayer thing isn't really bothering me. It's just I'm like, this is such a vast improvement for me playing the game on my own and just exploring this mm-hmm. universe that I'm in, I am personally enjoying. Yeah. But, Sean, <laughs> sorry. Sidebar: I almost bought the new Homefront for two dollars from a uh, Redbox. That's what, that's bought? way too much money. <laughs> well, that's way too expensive. I wouldn't I was pay ten to hold it fucking in. cents yeah. for that game. It's not worth two dollars. No. I've got two dollars worth of change in my car right now. <laughs> you can spend it on literally anything else that's better. Speaking that's right. of pre orders a like cheeseburger. A, like a butterfinger. <laughs> right. well, speaking yeah. of speaking of pre orders, um I did I forgot to mention I did actually pre order the new uh COD World War Two to get access to the private beta. So <laughs> <laughs> Drew's having a hell of an right, eye yeah, <laughs> Dude, no, okay, no. Uh, Drew, the new the new COD game looks fucking cool. Like it's <laughs> It's there's got it's got a lot of different modes. It's more like Battlefield as opposed to Call I'd be, of Duty. I'd be interested to see it. I'd, I I would be lying if I and there's if I and there's I'd be interested in one of the cool at it. one of the cool game modes that I've been seeing in the trailers is they have like an objective based game type. So where like you have attackers and defenders. So it's not just like running around free. For, like they obviously have your team deathmatch and stuff because that's you know COD like normal like normal Call of Duty. But like there's you know, missions where like you're you're a German you're a German battalion that's under siege in a in a in a village, or you're like an American team that's trying to escort like armor through this uh through this town or whatever, get to an objective across a bridge or whatever. But like it's there there's gonna be a lot of different dynamics and variety to the gameplay, which it looks I feel Super like Activision good. is paying you to say all this. It was like a pitch you were just giving. <laughs> yeah, yeah you're you're money. You're not telling here. I mean, I do. I do work in. I do work in sales technically. Uh, so sure, <laughs> Activision for some money. Yeah, you know they've so. got it. Right. Yeah. Oh yeah. They're, they're, they can wipe their ass. Companies that they people wipe are like hundreds. companies that suck. It's a uh, fucking Activision is like the most money grabbing one. Hey, but they're partnered with Blizzard though. Yeah. <laughs> Ubisoft is in France. So I, I'm trying to think what else I played. Uh, I actually played Advanced Warfare too because me and Jared. Speaking of COD, me and Jared wanted to get back in that, and it's fucking madness. The game's crazy. It has its moments, but it's also insanely infuriating. I expected so, so. much a bigger reaction from him playing No Man's Sky <laughs> from you, Drew. Drew's very. I was kind of disappointed. <laughs> it was like Logan, just like, oh yeah, I bought No Man's Sky yeah. as well. I wouldn't be like, what, what? <laughs> but actually, it, that fucking No Man's Sky, it's, I they they must have added a lot of stuff because. A lot of people are saying, you know, there's nothing new, it's boring. I keep saying I'm going to get off after this thing. And then I'm like, oh, there's something over there, though. So I go check out that thing. Then my radar says there's more resource over here that I need or a lot of money. I was like, fuck, now I got to do that. So that game, I literally, I, there's always like the one more thing to that's do. That's probably how you know when a game is like pretty good. Like when you like see stuff and you're just going, oh, I can't put it down. Yeah, I It's just go like this. that kind of carrot in front of you. It just, it keeps leading you further and further. It's, it's like, well, like fuck, it's like the fucking carrot on, yeah. the, on the, on the stick. Pretty much. Like yeah. in front of you. You, you can't, you, you can't quite reach it. And then his job calls him and be like, why have you been to work for the last three days? <laughs> <laughs> 
Because there's Emerald over here and uh, it's so much money. Yeah. You gotta re- they got to fucking mine it. Have you seen the galactic trade? It's up 2.4% right? right now on the galactic trade market. You got to watch how much. Yeah, the, like I oh got a bunch of gold and I, I hung onto it for a little bit to go to the next system to try to sell it and it was not. I should have that, it. Pat. I got yeah, to yeah, check my Bitcoin now. So. You reminded me of that. Yeah, right. But uh, I, I did a lot more multiplayer. Holy I just, fuck. Okay. Wow. Okay. Sorry. Good for <laughs> you, Worth. Yeah. Uh, fucking, I did a lot of Halo 5, a lot of uh, the Warzone firefight. Did, um, is that good or bad, Worth? That's great. Yeah? Yeah. Um, you know, business podcast now. Uh, Bitcoin's up to $4,250 a share right now, so. Woo. Yeah. Get on that. Did you buy it? Numbers. I Yeah, I've, I bought some. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but anyway, sorry. <laughs> I think that's pretty much it. Nice. There's a lot of multiplayer stuff. Just waiting for Spider-Man, right? I think that's it. Oh, and uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. I oh, yeah, you did, oh, yeah, you did play it? Yeah. Nice. Good well, game. I've been playing it for the last two or ever since I got the PlayStation. Did you beat that, Drew? I haven't played it. Oh, you haven't played it? I thought you did play it. No. It's, it's very good. It's I want to play it. Pretty awesome. <laughs> He's got a physical copy. When I, no, uh, I don't. I returned it and got the digital. <laughs> what? Because <laughs> I wanted digital instead. Oh, I actually got rid of it. had the chance. And Drew I, I had like, to get up it was once. right there. In front I had to get up once to take the disc out. And I was like, never doing this again. <laughs> Look, this is a stupid idea. What other idea. discs do you have? I took it out. I was thinking I was going to put it in a Blu-ray to see if that worked or whatever. Because with the Xbox, you need to, like, to have an app downloaded. I didn't even put the Blu-ray in. I was like so mad. I started playing like something. One, like one movie. <laughs> one movie. Just Watching root. one movie decided <laughs> that you were going to turn. Yeah, I took a disc out. I looked stuff. at it. And I was like, nope, I'm getting digital. Oh, I love bullshit. it. This is the funniest fucking so, thing ever. Yeah. But I think that's all I've been playing. Yeah. Good. Good variety this week. So news. News. What is the news? News. I got uh, something. I'll start off. Go. Uh, I also purchased one other game, but I didn't say I played it because I just wanted to wait for this. Sonic Mania came out. Really? I don't know if you guys... Everybody's been raving about it. I played it. Battlefield 1. For <laughs> <to say that. laughs> Thank you. Well, so, okay, so what, uh, what's, what's... Oh, dude, it's the biggest fan service fucking nut job you've ever seen in your life. It's good, it's, though, right? What does yeah. that even mean? I, like... I don't even know. I'm just so happy about the game that I can't even, like, make correct sentences or terms. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, it's everything. It's nostalgia to where... So, like, right when you start the game has the original like Sega like Sonic 2 graphics going with it and everything. All the mini games are like the original kind of graphics at the same time. They're just polished and like the frame rate's better and everything. Like you notice it right away when you're playing it. But then like the first thing you do is when you jump and start your game, it looks like Sonic 3 where you're like riding on the plane with tails and then all of a sudden you bump in this thing and there's all these robotnik like robots and they take a chaos emerald out and all the screen goes blah, 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 and then you are in Green Hill Zone. So you start at Sonic 1, even nice. though it looks like you're playing Sonic 3 right away. And there's they have original levels in it, and 2, I haven't got to those yet, but right now, they've combined, they brought in like the aspects and the power-ups from Sonic 2 and 3 and allowed you to use them in Sonic 1. Gotcha. So that's where the nostalgic and the new stuff comes to, and then they have different like mini-games from like Sonic Adventure, like on the Sega CD... <laughs> And all that stuff, it's it's really fun. Like it's for the price and how much content so far, it's pretty f- amazing. It has an eighty six nice. on Metacritic. That's it's good. It's good. That's cool. pretty good. That's insane good for a Sonic game, even. <laughs> yeah. Well, the old school Sonic games that this well, is a part of were awesome. Well, that's what I'm saying. But like the old school Sonic was good, but like new Sonic is like eh. Sonic Generations. I thought was great. Sonic Generations was like the I best, the best one in recent that's history. That's a great game. Yeah. Yeah. I the best was great. And the same guy history. who did Generations did helped with Sonic Mania. Good. So Good, as he should. It's the same, yeah, it's the same, yeah. But we don't talk about Sonic 06 or Sonic Boom or Sonic, Sonic and the Black Knight yeah. or whatever the fuck is it. You know, you know, all, you know all, all of the Sonic games. I do know all the Sonic I games because I want to watch Game Grumps. I want each and every one of them to be good, and I'm like, these all of these are equally as bad except for Sonic Generation. Watching Aaron lose his shit to Sonic games is like my favorite thing ever. I'm fucking Game done. Games. This is bullshit. Oh, yeah. Unavoidable chin move. <laughs> the best. Oh but uh, I, yeah, it's. I mean, it it just has the look and style of the nostalgia. And again, you're gonna hear that you know word all the time if you look at reviews and everything about it. I mean, you can tell it's a fan service game. You know what I mean? Yeah, I think it was designed for yeah. fans. You'd hope of, so, being a remaster, right? Yeah. <laughs> no, I <don't>. Well, I, <laughs> we, I wouldn't even call it a remaster. It I mean, it does have, like I said, it has a, a multitude of original levels, but then they throw back to the the old school. Do they make new stuff for this then? 
Yeah. Oh, I didn't realize that. That's what that. I mean. Yeah, well, when I say when I'm saying original, yeah. I mean like they came up with their own original levels to well, design, yeah. well, that's not cool. the original levels of the old school. Yeah, game. so there is some new stuff. Yeah. Well, that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, there's tons of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it shows that. And then they have different modes and they have all this fun multiplayer stuff that I've even checked out. Yeah. Like there's multiplayer? Yeah. What? Well, I mean it's like time trial bullshit. That's about it. Like, oh, leaderboards. Like, you know, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, wait. Oh, that's still kind of cool. I compete. wonder though. Could you? If, let's and say, you have multiple characters you can play with, so it's even that's more fun. You can play as either Sonic, Tails, or Knuckles. That's what I'm saying. Like, if you're playing multiplayer any level, if yep. you're playing multiplayer, can you play co-op? Like, one person be Tails, one pay, one person be Sonic or Knuckles or whatever. I don't know because I haven't tried it. Oh. This is bullshit. I want to be Big the Cat. <laughs> no, you, <laughs> you don't. don't. No one wants to be Big the Cat. <laughs> no one wants to be fishing for cat. frogs is not fun drew do they have like the bonus stages from like yeah. sonic one and everything. sonic two everything they do yeah. even like the running path with sonic and tails they and collecting the rings and correct the chaos emeralds? Yep. they have that one they have the uh sonic adventure one where you're trying to catch the uh, robot that has the emerald and you have to keep picking up like the speed boost orbs uh-huh where it's like you drift you know when you like turn and everything and then they have the Sonic 3 one where, you know, you collect the blue spheres and they yeah. turn into coins and all that shit. Like what about the everything. the original one they have? Sonic 1, the stage? Mm-hmm. Right? The pinballs and everything? Yeah. yeah. The, it's it's everything, dude. I'm wow. telling you. The it's, real question is, can you roll around at the speed of sound? Um, You can. And the other thing that is amazing for... I haven't really utilized it that much, but for time trials, I can see how useful it is. You have the ability to, like... Remember when you would click down and try to spin... You'd have to come to a complete stop to do it mm-hmm. before you could do it. Like even if you were moving a little bit, they totally changed that to now. You once you land, you can go straight into a spin again. So like once you get the timing down to doing it, I can see how like speed runs of like these levels are gonna be fucking insane <laughs> to watch because of what people could do. And they've even added more areas to like Green Hill Zone, the original levels that weren't in. So, you son of a. <laughs> bitch. Uh, that, that weren't in the original game. Like, there's other areas you can go to. So they, like, I, in the two Green Hill Zone acts, I went to almost six, yeah, five or six bonus levels, if that tells you. Yeah. And they were different ones. So, yeah, they definitely, like I say, when I say it's a fan service game, it's it's fan service. Listen, guys, I like Sonic, okay? I love Sonic. No reason to flip off. No, uh, no, not I'm flipping them off. You gotta go fast. I had a Sega before I had a SNES, so... Who? Yeah, I had, I had to yeah. say no. Oh, Sean, yeah. was flip, Sean was flipping Drew off. I flipped Sean off. I didn't know such thing. Sean. I I'm, just, I'm trying to you did. organize my news here. See what I'm talking about next. <laughs> no, dude. Sonic is Sonic will all by, like by and large always be my favorite like game character. Americanized ever, so. like video game is like one of the first main American video game. I characters grew up with a Sega ever. Yeah, I was yeah. a Sega kid. Sega for Sega. sure. That was my OG. Um, and then yeah, we got the SNES. But though. do they have that song in the game? The rolling around at the speed of sound. That game? I haven't song? heard. Isn't that Sonic no. X or something? That was from no, that was from Sonic 06. Yeah. Oh god. god. That Round game at is the speed terrible. of sound. <laughs> got places to go. Got. I uh, have PTSD. The only the only <laughs> Sonic game. song that I will always hold dear to my heart was the Saturday morning cartoon where it's like Blue Streak speeds by Sonic the Hedgehog. Too, too fast, fast for, for the, the naked eye. That right, should be the, that should be the Sonic intro. Nah, the I like Hedgehog. I like the Sonic Adventure Sonic, theme song. He could really move. Sorry, <laughs> little fun fact for those of you that don't know the uh, fucking Sonic 06. The uh, the voice actor for Sonic in that cartoon was Urkel. Yeah, yep. Jaleel White. Jaleel White. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's Stephon always Urkel. eating chili dogs. Always eating, always eating chili, chili dogs. dogs. Yep. Anyway, I Sonic Mania. I mean. If you're a fan of Sonic and you have the extra like side cash to do, because it's not the price is perfect for it's it. It's like forty anyway. bucks. Yeah. 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 I enjoying it. Good. F- thoroughly. Good. I'm glad there's a there's a good Sonic game finally. Or, thoroughly. Well <laughs> again. I'm glad the old Sonic games are still good. <laughs> again, I should say. Not right. finally. Again. The best game since generations. Yeah. Yeah. Since generations. Yeah. Sean, generations. Are you leaving us. Maybe. You yeah. son of a bitch. As Sean, usual. Fuck you. So this is kind of interesting. Guess guess what was the top selling game of July this year? Uh, I'm gonna say Minecraft. No Man's Sky. I'm gonna say Siege. It was last July. Siege. Sean, what was the highest selling game this year in July? In July? Yeah. Minecraft of this year. I'm gonna say Siege. Okay. Drew, do you have a real answer? Or you? <laughs> I don't remember what came out. It's come out recently, yeah. Get on the mic, you son. Or did you turn it down? I did turn it Uh, down. No, fuck you, Sean. It doesn't matter. There you go. You can talk. Go. I don't know. PUBG? Splatoon 2. 
What? <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. Yeah. <laughs> the, that, that first game was super popular. Yeah. So Splatoon, it's, it's, the first one was pretty fun, actually. I considered so. buying it. Yeah. I forget you had a Switch, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm the only one here that has so, a Switch. I know. You are. <laughs> we all make mistakes. Some, <laughs> no. 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 Have you I played still want Zelda? A Switch. Yeah. You can shut up. <laughs> yeah. You can <laughs> shut up. I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of jealous. God damn you it. Zelda on the pot. Yeah. That's going to be great. Yeah, Playing Zelda play, on the I pot. I can play Destiny. Isaac on the pot, too. <clears throat> well, we gotta, Bye, Sean. We got to clean that, brah. Well, um, we have dead yeah, on the mic. that seriously is like uh, surprising. I didn't think that game would be that popular. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it's obviously very there, competitive. Yeah. It's extremely competitive. Yeah. yeah. And I, I played the first one. I really, really liked it. I just I would say a majority of that is Japan. Probably. And I Europe. Majority, and Europe. You'd say, yeah. In Europe, yeah. I don't think a lot. Of, like, I don't think the the higher American percentage is playing Splatoon. I don't know. America's full of a bunch of first person shooter bros. That fucked your mom. <laughs> that escal- escalated quickly. Not bros, squeakers, squeakers and bros, bro squeakers. And bros. squeakers. <laughs> That's Anything a, else? That should be a song, squeakers and bros. Uh, this What's coming that? Gamescom, the Xbox One X pre order info is going to be released. So pay attention to that if you want an Xbox One X. I'll tell you when. I thought it was already available so, for pre-order. I don't think so. I, I think it's saying that the news is going to be released at uh, oh, Gamescom. Okay. Nice. Gotcha. So. And a PlayStation exclusive is coming up, too. I got to watch that. What's that one? It's just PlayStation's own little like convention thing. Oh, the, the, oh yeah. yeah. Whatever. What's that called? PS4 exclusive. PSX. PSX. Yeah, PSX. Call it. There's a, it's there's a PlayStation the exclusive. Yeah. yeah, my bad. PSX. Yeah. PSX. There you go. So you can <laughs> technically... Experience. Maybe it is PlayStation experience. Yeah, uh, I, think, right? I don't know. Anyway, you maybe would kind of want to watch. I it. never have to use to care, but now I can. I know well, you can. They might show more so. Spider-Man or more exclusives. It's so weird. I've been like yeah, an now, Xbox now you have a reason to so care. Long. A reason to give a shit. I probably played the most this week of No Man's Sky. I played a shit ton of that game. It's fun. Yeah, you weren't online very it's much. Cool. Yeah, I was playing. No Man's like Sky I said, Drew, I wouldn't still pay sixty dollars for it, and it's definitely not a game for everyone. But it's. It's improved. If you enjoy the discovery thing, that's uh-huh. totally cool. But a yeah. lot of a lot of people were saying it's it probably should have been released as an early access game, oh, yeah. and then everybody would have been like, "This is the greatest thing ever." You kind of you know what I mean? It, have the expectation set for yeah. for what it was. No, so, I I agree yeah, thoroughly. Totally, I'm not yeah. I'm not trying to defend so them anymore. And I don't think anybody here cares. But new Overwatch map and animated shorts coming out next week. I like. The I do want to see the animated shorts. shorts. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> we don't care about the game. We just want to see the characters. I'm shorts. telling you, man, Overwatch movie. You'll make millions, Blizzard, without even trying. They've, they've already done one movie. Well, what movie. Warcraft. Warcraft. Oh, Warcraft. Yeah, I still haven't seen that. And I'm like the biggest Warcraft Lord nerd. Is it any everyone. good though? It's like, good. No, I heard fan, great. It's good. Things. Okay. If, yeah. If, if you're a fan, if you're not really a fan, you won't really know what's going on because the plot line's kind of all over the place. But it's it's good. Yeah. I enjoyed it a if lot. If you played the game, you know the story. But yeah, if you're walking into the story, it might be a little confusing. A lot of fan service. Thrall. Thrall's in it. No. Thrall. Oh, hey man, thrills. Leroy Jenkins was supposed to be in it too. Was he really? <laughs> like the actual him, guy? They cut him out. Yeah. Oh damn. Oh, yeah, because he great. was. Uh, they were gonna like uh, get in a war. Like the alliance was supposed to get in a war with the orcs, and he was supposed to be like a guy that charged out in the middle of the field. <laughs> and said his and name. And then he got fan wasted. service. But uh, for some, whatever reason, uh, he got he got. They, uh, they cut that from the movie. Yeah, they cut it. That's ridiculous. Because that those are the things you want in that kind of movie. Exactly. You get, like, yeah. Uh, one really memorable like scene for me was this: they're crossing over some bridge or something like that, and there's a little murloc under the bridge. He's like, Murr! and he's like, <laughs> and the computer animated him and stuff, and it looks awesome. And you're like, yes, this is so <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Fuck you, murloc. Little inside jokes kind of thing. Yeah, it, they, uh, yeah, they do that kind of thing. It's 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 cool. I enjoyed it. I like it. Do you have that top ten list thing you were talking about? Ah. Uh. Or did no, you I didn't lose it. it. I'll, I'll figure it out real quick. Lose it. But the other, I guess this is somewhat of a big topic. Um, the uh, delayed Crackdown three out of the holiday. Oh, yeah, until we next were going to talk about that. Yeah. But how are we, we going to wait to put out this? Uh, were we really excited game? for that game until the right, I guess a lot of people are really dude. I love a the lot first of crackdown. people loved the first one especially. So and I know specifically people that say they've wanted one. I know one person very specific that said they're going to buy an Xbox for this game. So really, it's, it's it's a popular game among the fans. It's really. Like there's just yeah. something about like like walking anywhere and like fucking jumping like the goddamn Hulk like you're jumping like fucking a hundred feet in the air, like just anywhere you want, and so you can just jump from building to building. Like it's yeah. fucking awesome. Well, and there's and there's a pretty cool amount, of dude. It's sweet. <laughs> you're like walking down the street and you're like boom. 
we were flying, dude. It's so cool. But it's actually like controllable because you know how you could do like moon gravity and shit and like mm-hmm. Grand Theft Auto. So like it actually has like a control like feel good feature when you're doing it. Yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. Yeah. Well, it's it, there's like a lot of like um, levolution in the game too. Like you can level like Plays buildings and Terry shit. Williams. Yeah. In Crackdown Three. Yeah. Well, like in in any of the Crackdown games, there's been a lot of like. You, know, you, you could blow up buildings and shit Have like that. Have you played huh? I played the first one. Oh, okay. I mean, the first one was pretty fun, but like this um, second one looked kind of the same, so I was just like, eh, whatever. But I don't know. I never played two, but the I first never, one was I excellent. guess the first one, I think, is pretty much the generally uh, like the agreed upon well better done. one, yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. so. Yeah, and the new one, it's uh, the multiplayer is 100% destructible. I think the single player isn't because it's kind of they still want to contain a story a little bit. Yeah. So I think you can just still destroy stuff, but not everything. They have single player in the game? Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought yeah, it was, it was just going to be a straight player. up no. multiplayer game. I don't game. think they've ever been oh, multiplayer. Oh, that only. makes me a little more interested yeah. then in that game. Yeah. There's always been single player for Crackdown. It's yeah. like um, more highly evolved GTA. Yeah. Kind of. If you mix GTA with like prototype. Or infamous or yeah, something infamous. like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good. Per- that's comparison. that's a good. Uh, like that's with a good guns with guns and, and nice. stuff. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that's basically that's, what you got. That sounds intriguing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I forgot about prototype. Yeah, prototype is fucking good. Yeah. yeah. That Johnny Cash trailer that they had mm-hmm. back in the day. I remember that one. That's for prototype two. That w- that was for prototype yeah. two. Yeah. But um, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Well, um, anything else? Anything else? What we got to talk talk about this week? Uh, I know, obviously, it's like over halfway into the year, but I kept seeing this list last couple of days of games that came out in twenty or two thousand seven. So games that are ten years old this year. Oh God! Um, Bioshock is one of them. The original Bioshock. Okay. Uh, COD four, Halo okay. three. Okay, those are oh all God. good games. <laughs> well, yeah. it's funny because this is the year. I think seven was not, not Drew. The rest of us, I think we all graduated in 07, right? Yeah, we I all graduated in 07. Yeah, yeah so I gra- we graduated in 2007. Drew, yeah. old son of a bitch. What year did you graduate? Oh, six, oh five. Five. <laughs> oh, five. <laughs> But no, because I'm thinking about like these are the games I played my first year of college. Mostly. I used to, I used to yeah. play I used to play strip Halo with my ex girlfriend at that time. Was when, the Sky Halo, when Halo Three came out? Nice. Yeah, they were simpler times. The Sky Blue. <laughs> they Pe- were better times. Does Pet? Did you have Pepperidge Farm? Pepperidge Farm remembers. <laughs> no, like we would like we played one on ones, and every time one of us died, we take off an article of clothing. So that was nice. That was pretty <laughs> fun. <laughs> I miss that. The uh, this actually Rock Band came out that year too. That's the whole fucking yeah, first Rock craze. Band. Yeah, I guess Guitar Hero started it, but Rock Band like people freaked out. See, rock Guitar Band. Hero didn't get really popular until Guitar Hero two though. Like I think so. That was yeah, Guitar took Hero. Off. Go, get, yeah. The first one was you know pretty successful, but uh, it didn't really take off yeah. till the second one. Yeah, that's when people like lost. Their I shit remember those it. days. Remember going to a party? Oh god! You go to a party and like it kind of be winding down, or like people would just be chilling, and I'd always be the dude that's like, "Dude, is that Guitar Hero over there in the corner?" We. Should Fucking turn that shit on right now. So yeah, that was like the late 2000s. Dude, I miss thing. Rock yeah, Band. Dude, I miss Rock Band parties Every so party much. you went to, you were like, That's oh funny. man, Rock Band. Uh, the Orange Box also came out this year. This so year? That, that the year of the, the, uh, I'm talking that, about. You said that year. 2007. Year. Well, I'm saying the year of our conversation. Yeah, no, I'm, just, I'm giving damn you it shit. Worth. Please smack him in the back uh, of the head here. <laughs> so that was Portal, Team Fortress 2. I think those all came out that year. It's not just that the collection came out, those were when they released, right? Well, Half Life Two was in the was in the orange box also. Yeah, so, so that, that was that, that was, was Half Life Two like episode two. I thought yeah. Half Life Two came out in two thousand four. I can't remember. I want to say I don't know. We'll have to look that up later. But something like that. Um, the original Witcher came out. Nice. Um, I didn't realize the Guitar Hero Three came out that year. So they came out the exact same year. Yeah. Yeah. Super Mario Galaxy was another big one. Yes. Unreal Tournament Three, which was not as good as some yeah. of the ones before. Uh, what else this year? There's one, there was one or two other ones that I thought were interesting. Peggle. That was one of them. Peggle? Oh, Peggle? <laughs> really? <laughs> Ooh, uh, um, Wasted Ghost Recon, many of ours. Advanced Warfighter 2 came out that year. That was a good one. Oh, shit. A Crisis. The first one. The first, first Crisis came out, yeah. Uh, Assassin's Remember? Creed. And it's still melting PCs to this day. Right. Oh, yeah. talking of cra- Crackdown. The first Crackdown came out that, that same <laughs> year. God, Burning Crusade came out. Yeah. 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 Skate. D- that was my super skate. illegal. Didn't, I shouldn't have uh, driven. Mass Effect came out that year, too. Yeah, Mass Effect did come out. Didn't yeah. GTA 4 come out? Or was that 2008? Eight. Uh, eight. It was eight. Yeah. Okay. Well. So those are the big titles that I saw, but that was a fucking awesome year for gaming. I always thought that yeah, 2007 was so good. So so I, remember when I, I remember when I saw like the, the poster like mar- and marketing for uh, Modern Warfare, because like, all the other COD games I played up until then were all, were all World War II, and yeah, then I'm like, historical. oh my god, that's a, that's not, that's a helicopter. They didn't have those <laughs> in World War II. Fuck, I'm excited for those. What didn't they have? A hel- they didn't have helicopters. They didn't have helicopters. Well, II? they they probably like had prototypes of helicopters in World War Two, but they weren't like 
effective enough to I don't fly. know helicopters came into I know they were existence. in Vietnam War, obviously. They were in the Korean War. Yeah. Drew goes to the internet. Yeah, I got, I got it. I got it. Damn. Anyway. Uh, 2008 was a good year, too. Dude, 2018 this year is going to be a good year. You know how many good games are coming out this year? Or this upcoming year? I'm trying to think of what has been announced for 2018, like confirmed. Uh, a bunch Spider-Man. of stuff on Sony side. Spider-Man. Yeah, Sony's got yeah, it's gonna, balls well, to the wall. Well, because their E3 this year was the same E3 as last year, so yeah. it's about time this shit comes out. Dude, Kingdom Hearts 3 yeah. is coming out. <laughs> yeah, maybe. No, it said coming. It said we'll coming see. 2018. We'll I know. See. Trust me. Don't fuck my right. hopes up though. But I mean, like Shadow of Colossus HD remake, God of War, um, Monster Hunter World. Dude, you should get Monster Hunter World. We'll play that together. That looked cool. Yeah. Monster Hunter does. That's look MMOE, fun, yeah. but it's really more yeah. intense than you think it is. It's That's, really fun. I definitely get that on PlayStation, so we could we could we play, play that. together. Yeah, that'd be cool. I mean, it's when I say it's tedious, it's not like annoying, but you have to think like a hunter. You know, right. you just can't go in guns a blazing. Got to yeah. be like, hey, let's set up some traps. You run up and distract it, make it run here. I'll have my gun ready to go, and then as it hits the trap, I blast. Kind of sounds like if, like what Evolve should have been like. But well, that sounds a lot like Horizon Zero Dawn too, because those kind of big enemies you have to you can't just run up and start beating the shit out of them. You gotta you can put down the electric trap or then whatever weakness there too. You set down the, mm-hmm. like the bomb trap. Uh, you gotta like pick and choose where you attack from. So yeah. that Monster Hunter sounds like you can use fun. the environment to your advantage too and everything. Like you saw in that trailer where there, he like had set up a big boulder on the ceiling. Oh yeah. And so as the cre- as the T Rex thing was chasing after him, he like jumped in the air and cut the wire and then that boulder fell on top right. of it. I'm like, <laughs> oh my God, let's fucking watch that That's so cool, man. I love I have I've played I played the original Monster Hunter on PS2. I have the D S version now, uh number Ultimate Three. But Monster Hunter World, like a full it's been a while since Monster Hunter has been on a console. Mm-hmm. Like, and it's been a DS thing for a while. It's been DS for yeah. a long yeah, it's time. Been a it's been on so. it's been on Nintendo consoles, like on Wii U and stuff. And uh, Switch, I know, is probably mm-hmm. going to get a copy of it. But um, yeah, it's been a long time since it's actually come up to like a PlayStation right. console. Yeah, so I'm excited. I love that series. <laughs> to answer your question, Pat, um, helicopters were invented in 1939, but they weren't used in wartime applications until the Korean War. Gotcha. So there you go. Got to it. answer your question. God, 2007 was such a good year. <laughs> Hello, God, that was so good. Good segue. Good, yeah. Yeah. Assassin's Creed good segue. Good. <laughs> History lesson to... 1939. Two. Man, 2007 was a great year. Metroid yeah. Prime 3 came well, out that year. I don't know if it was any good or not. Uh, Metroid was Prime, that was the Wii one, right? Yes. Yeah, yes. I had that one. That one was good. Yeah. Got a war Except two. for the, uh, the uh, ship underwater portion, I remember, was really annoying because it was impossible to find out where you were going. <laughs> it was always dark. It was so dark, and you couldn't... like The way you were trying to figure out the way you were moving through the map, it was it was annoying. It just didn't work. It was like the Twilight Princess statue puzzle, which was took me way longer than it should have to figure <laughs> out how to beat it. That one was dumb. You had two statues that would jump opposite sides, and you had to get them to move together, but then there were a bunch of like small blocks in the way that they couldn't jump on. So you had to like get the pattern down correctly, right. and it was dumb. I I wouldn't know because I don't have never really played Zelda games all that oh, much. I I'm sorry. I I'm, I know I'm like. The odd man out in this case. Wait, Logan probably is true. Yeah, the same either. Little fun news that you heard about Zelda. Nah. Yeah, nah. exactly. Mm. Tell everyone to buy a PC, something like that. Well, any time is a good time to buy a <laughs> yeah, PC. Obviously, <laughs> I can play PUBG. Possibly do it. Download it. I'll yeah, try. According to Drew, you can do it easily. I'm sure you could on that <laughs> computer. You could yeah. run it fine on that. You'd have no problems. I should probably in- I should probably invest in a decent gaming mouse though if I'm going to do that. Sure. Yeah. They're not expensive. How much? How, okay. What What's like a good amount of money to spend on a gaming mouse. I don't know, anywhere from like 60 to to $100. Depending on how many buttons you want. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. I'll figure it out. I have a decision to make. What color it is? <laughs> you get ones that are RGB that you can customize colors on. I might. Oh, really? No, yeah. I mean, I probably get one that's like, like blue. LED light on them yeah, I've got one. Nice. I'm kind you of still a... have your clicky-ass keyboard? Yes, he does. No, I don't. Oh, you oh, got rid of God, it? God, those are well, so I, loud. Steph I have it, Every time. it's... <laughs> Mine's a stealth now. I got the same model of my keyboard, but it doesn't have the clicky keys. Nice. This clicky one sounds like you're playing a game on a typewriter. <laughs> <laughs> I remember <laughs> every time yeah. we'd be That's playing. That's how you know WoW. it's working. <laughs> yeah, is that it? Is that what you do? <laughs> every time we'd be playing World yeah. of Warcraft, I'd be like, "Oh God, Drew, fucking <laughs> shut your shut keyboard off." off. <laughs> click, 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 click. Oh God, it's so loud. Dun. And it felt like every time because I was so used to like a flat keyboard on my laptop when that when I would like play on your like computer, I felt like a fucking chimpanzee trying to click with like 
my f- I have no idea fingers. what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> everything just is different now. I when you go know. to a keyboard that's not yours, you're like, it's, what language? How do I use this? I don't understand. It's so weird how your what mind machine is like, I is have this? no idea what I'm doing right now. This isn't a controller. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, I think that's the news, though. Right? Yeah, There's news the I can't really find anything else, so. Sorry. This we'll have more be... stuff coming up because yeah, PSX is coming yeah. up and be, yeah. yeah, Gamescom. Slower, so, yeah. slower news. Yeah, yeah so there's the just not a whole lot to talk so. about right now. So this might be the shortest podcast we've ever done. No man's no, sky. No, we check it out. This is like a forty something minute podcast. If yeah, you install, whatever. if yeah. you bought No Man's Sky, check it out. Yeah, That's the anybody one thing listens. I will say. It's a uh, anybody listens. You hear me, Jake well, Boone? Bob, it's okay. <laughs> he's still not going to agree with me, but <laughs> no, he's not going to no. agree with me. Sean Murray is dead to Jake. No, I know. Yeah. All right. Well, that's uh, that's a wrap this week. Episode 18. 18. Goodbye. Goodbye.